after Nice's draw on Friday evening. Monaco knew they could move up to second and to within one point of leaders PSG if they could take all three points home from Le Havre. The Norman side began the day nine points but just four places behind the visitors after an impressive start to the season. New signing Andre Ayou was paraded on the Stade Océan pitch ahead of the game. But for now, goal scoring responsibilities remained with Loic Nego and Mohamed Bayo, amongst others. And the former nearly grabbed his first ball out since his summer move inside the first 10 minutes when Antoine Juju robbed Guillermo Maripan. But Nego's shot from a tight angle was well saved by Philip Kahn. Monaco settled as the first half went on though, and Ismail Jacobs drew the first save from and opposite number Arthur Demar inside the half hour. Nice dummy, good work from Ben Yedder as well. But straight at Demar in the end. That save was easy enough. The next one was far trickier. Brilliant reactions. Infuriated that the ball was allowed to get that close to his goal. No more major chances followed. And it was nil-nil at the break. Love have lost just once in their last five home top flight games. Winning two and drawing two after having lost the previous six. Proving difficult to beat again here, even for high-flying Monaco. And the home side started the second half as they had the first brightly. Juju forced another save from Kern. And it's Zakaria also tried his luck down the other end, but didn't test Demar. has continued to come out on top. A long ball forward. Ending up with a one-on-one. -on -one. But Kern standing tall. If he wasn't already the hero, there would be one more big moment for the German-Swiss shot stopper. A moment in the box, which would result in a VAR check deep into injury time. And Diop judge to have fouled Emmanuel Sabi. In fact, the penalty will be taken in the 10th minute of added time. Samuel Gronzier with the penalty. But Kern was to have the last say once again. Five shots saved from open play. And then denying the former Monaco man from the penalty spot with the final action of the game. The last time Monaco kept a clean sheet at the Stade Océan, back in March 2003, but Kern is set on putting an end to that particular stat on this day.